guys and welcome to the video and I hope you are feeling awesome. Alright guys, on today's adventure we're venturing back to a previous location. We went there on um, Adventure 12 and we did the old engine pit area and we came across some water and I said that I will be returning to that location again. So today we are going to see exactly what it is in that area. Just over there is the old engine pit where we went in uh, Adventure 12, as I've said, we have now got to make our way over to this direction here. I have no idea if this was supposed to be in a road at some point. Alright, I decided to get myself up on this section of the ground because down there, as you can see, is a lot of water there. So I've came up here and I'm looking down here and I'm like, wow, I can actually see partial bits of where this water course is going. If you look just down in the area where I'm circling and just over here as well, right, that area there, that is the water source that we want to get to. What have we got? What is that? It's like a bolt that goes through there and a metal there. I'm not too sure what that is or what the purpose of it is for. Okay, we've got a concrete post there. I'm not too sure why you have a concrete post there. You've got a few more going over there as well. Oh, right. We have another concrete post here. So, was this original boundary line here? It kind of does line up with the other one that's behind those trees over there. Alright, let's see if we can find this water area. I've got to get out of my boots and get into my wellies. Because if you look at this map now, you can see there's a load of these blue lines that obviously represent water, right? So the one that we're actually on is this one here. So we're going to try and work our way that way on it. So hopefully this don't go down too deep. Oh my days. I am no way going to go into that. Look how deep my foot goes there, guys. Alright, let's see if I can walk on this grass to give me a bit of stability here. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, God. Ooh. Okay, I think I'm going to abandon the idea of walking in the water. Oh, flipping out, this area is really, really quite dangerous to walk on. That's not too bad to walk on this area here. All right, but then you come up against a situation like this, where this ground here has literally got a load of water. Well, I suppose you would call it like waterlog. Right, I need to get myself in over, preferably over in that area there. Now, this ground here looks very, very soft and when I mean soft I mean like any pressure you sink into it so think about it right you got these hills here so when obviously it rains the water obviously flows down here onto this section and drains into like things like a little swampy area I suppose you might call that right to give you a bit more perspective guys we've walked from that section over here and the water should be over this side here there we go there's the water there, it just come in down there. Flows that way. Whoa. It goes that way there. Crikey. This and we got another concrete post there. Got some bricks here. It's a brick there. Don't know what this it looks like two bricks are there or three in a line, not too sure. I'm finding bricks in the, uh, this area, and that there looks like a metal pipe of um, sorts. I haven't got a clue. Oh, this is two coming into one, because you've got a waterway that way, and you've got this one over here coming into this area here. But now we're on the other side of that area, 
So we're going to follow this around here. Look at that, another brick there. Oh, we've got brick there as well. Brick, there's bricks in there and here. What, what was there? Unless these bricks were like thrown into this area, I don't understand. Because I've looked at this map and I can't see anything or any building. This area is so much work, guys. Just look at all that water there. We go, we have the water course coming underneath all I don't know if you can see that where I'm pointing. The the camera's sort of in that area, that's where the water course goes. I'm gonna try and follow it as best I can. Ugh. Sounds like it's getting faster and faster. What's this? What's that? That's Is that slate? Does slate break like that? I'm not too sure. Ugh. Looks like it feeds into that section and goes further on down in that area there. Yay, I actually finally got to walk in it. I clean off my boots a little bit as well. <laughs> there we go, I thought I'd set myself up on this branch here and have a little bit of a break. What an absolute beauty to find. It actually, nobody would never know if you didn't look at maps that this uh, water course is here. All right, yeah, this is a nice little area. We were just up there in the beginning of this video. We did actually have a look down. I don't know where it was we looked. I'm getting myself a bit stuck here. This ground is so freaking soft and I'm struggling. So I need to get myself up here. We're gonna have to uh, sort of go a different direction because if you look down in that section there, it's literally impossible to get to. Oh God. Right, ah, there it is. See, just there. The water is coming that direction and it's coming over here. What the heck? All right. There we go. We've got the water coming in just over there. This wall here. I don't. I don't understand. Because look, it comes even this way. So, was this a bridge at one point, and obviously over time, but that's got a curve to it. And it looks like, oh, I really am puzzled. So it literally just carries on going this way here, down there. And you obviously you've got some bricks there, but those bricks could be from this. Wait. Look there, there is bricks there, and that soil is on top. So, now I've got a question. Now, was there a building here at one point that I cannot see on the map? But was this building, there was there a building on top of this area, and maybe it got powered by water? Like, some of it was powered by water. Let's see what else we can find. Well, this water, guys, is getting faster. You see a brick right in that area there. Bet that is really deep, that water. I need to get over there. Suppose we use the bridge. That'd be the sensible solution. Let's go this way. Right, if you remember, on Adventure 12, I came down there, we seen that bathtub, and we came into this area here. Then we had a, a look around here. I'm gonna try and carry on with it around here. 
but wait a second these were those pipes that I didn't understand where they went well in uh, Adventure 12 here we go let's go around here and it looks like we've got a bit of a situation what the heck is that right am I going to be able to walk across this or am I going to get sunk into the ground because I would like to get over to that area and come over to that area because there's some ducks in that area there We've just made it over to the other side. Right. Uh, they're here. Oh, God. The ground is so soft. What have we got over here anyway? Little duckies. It's about three, four there. Oh, hang on, there's more over here. Look at that. Oh, we never thought I would have came across ducks. It's a little better view here. We've got some duckies just there. It looks like this water goes down in that section there. It comes just there. It comes from over there. It's like that. That must be some sort of a um, sort of dam in a sense comes out underneath there and then it flows just down in here okay that there is concrete blocks what's the purpose of having concrete blocks there then that's actually a brick wall or it looks like a stone type of wall there and it just stops just right there don't make sense See, that's now two brick walls, or two walls of sorts, that I've came across. I don't know why they're there. Right, where are we going now? Where are you taking us, Walter? All right. Where is it? Oh! Oh, okay. That was a bit of an illusion. Right. Okay, guys. Got the water coming there and then it goes directly under this here and it pops out there and look at that there there is bricks just there why is there bricks underneath all this soil so it makes me question either there was a build here it got knocked down I have no idea so let's carry on here We've got a lot of, I mean, there's like a lot of bricks here. NCB, it looks like Hensford staffs on that brick. Wow. What I'm standing on feels like a lot of bricks here. So then this goes over here. And this is some sort of like a bridge here. And then it carries on going that way there. There we go. Goes for this area here. Got some bricks there on the floor. Some more bricks there. Why do I have this bad feeling guys? I'm going to end up coming to a dead end. There we go, it shoots off under there. It comes around here. And carries on going that way down there. And there you go guys, and that's the last you see of it because it shoots straight off over there. Because if you look at this map now, where I'm circling is where the um, water disappears and where the X is, is where it comes out and it comes out into the Trent and Mersey Canal. What an adventure we've had today then guys. But anyway, unfortunately it's where I'm going to have to love and leave you and I hope you've enjoyed today's adventure as much as I've enjoyed getting stuck in the mud. <laughs> so again, thank you for coming to watch the video and always do your best to stay positive and screw those negatives. And I'll see you on the next one. All right, bye, see bye.